Yeah, I, actually, I was expecting more too. I, I thought there was more. Alright, so we... We want to go to the Temple of Fire. So we can go that way, we can get this thing. I am the Lord of Deadside. This should be useful. What's this? We don't know. Uh, I don't think it, it doesn't do a ton of damage, Josh. Like it, it's not very strong. But the fact that it's homing really helps. I think that was the problem uh, pre-nerf was that it was it was also very strong. So it just became like the only weapon you used um, once you got it. You just didn't even bother with the other voodoo weapons. Alright, so for anyone following along on their maps, we just got La Lune. And now we're going through the, this little passageway, which will take us to... The Temple of Fire. And after we after we get some of Temple of Fire done, we will definitely uh, go to Temple of Life. Maybe that's what we'll do. I think we're gonna try and just like speed run part of Temple of Fire so that I can show you Temple of Life. It's pretty good. Still pretty good. Yeah, like that's new. Yeah, it's definitely strong enough, and that's the thing, like, it's an upgrade. In a way, it's an upgrade over the, you know, the Assault and like the first voodoo weapon you got because it's like homing and it shoots faster, but the Assault is still a lot stronger. Yeah, I think we'll, we'll try and speedrun Temple of Fire. Spoken of in whispers at the dead side margins, in the hushed and shivering tones of the lurking, lurching revenants. These ancient places, blood temples to the lower, where the dark souls did find their secret corner, hidden by the sanguinary sisters steeped in voodoo lore. Fish are gonna kill me. And one. 
100. start out with any enemies. No. All right. So every every like switch we hit these voodoo sisters, the sisters of blood. They awaken. And they start owning me. It's it's like that. Whoops. Did I finish beating all no, not even close. Um you know, I'm like still like over halfway done where I was, you know, like a year and a half ago. I just haven't played any. Um uh I think if I can like kind of get back in a streaming groove with this, then when I'm done with this, I will uh, I'll pick it back up. Yeah, dude. Like, it's definitely like. I think general consensus, like the hardest thing about this new difficulty, are the are the temples and dealing with the sisters. Like they, because the enemies in this difficulty get get an extra attack. Also, I don't know what that is for them, but like they're already difficult. So that's not doing us any favors. Holy, oh, I forgot to save. I meant to save. Dang it. I guess I could, I could also try not killing them. For speedruns sake. That might be the move. <laughs> All right, so whatever. We got that switch. Oh, where's James? Took him so long to realize you could shoot those. Sad. Dude, there's like five sisters in this one. Look at them floating around in there. The sister's awake. No, no. No. No, no. Get me out of here.
might have been a mistake to save there. We'll see. Fireball from downtown. Oh, I really thought I could roll under. Gets rolled. No. No. <laughs> the yoga flame guys. <laughs> the uh, the fireballs, yeah. <laughs> I think that's a cheat right there. I think you have to get it from the other direction now. If I remember correctly. Yoga Flame killed me, dude. Oh, yeah. Got it. I already have Max to do. Just gotta not get roasted. No. Just let me go fast. Yoga flame. Yeah, I think the intended way to get that is from the other direction. But, you know, we do what we want. That might be the, the like, play as dog cheat. Which means, obviously, we, we need it. No! Um, I think these voice lines all existed already, Josh. I, no, I don't think any stuff was, like, newly recorded. I think they existed and were remastered. Some might have been in different versions of the game. Okay, okay, I think I'm just gonna jump sideways. Like between PlayStation and Dreamcast and N64. Okay, or just don't let me jump. What? How do we get 
first try. <laughs> and now I just can't get it. Uh, no, because I loaded. Oh, you know what? I think I have them for my other game. But we definitely... I don't know. I'll try it again. I'll try it one more time. Alright. But, good thing we luck. Oh, wait. Not... We don't want that one. Play his dog. There we go. This is what the people want. I'm not sure you, you lose it when you die, but I'm willing to find out now. We can just, you know get it when we're supposed to. Now that I, I know I have already have the other ones unlocked. But it wasn't even that I died, I thought I reloaded. Like I loaded an old save. It wasn't just dying. The sister's awake. Bring it on idiots. Oh damn it. <laughs> Whoops. Yeah, they really make it tough to like you know, hit a switch and then run out because they're they're blocking your way out. It's like they knew. Look at that dog swim. Man, I can't believe I could have been playing as a dog this whole time. Game changer. Alright, you know what? I don't think maybe that would be help. Anyways. Oh no, they found me. Alright, those don't disappear. Oh, damn it. Coming back for all this. Oh, wait, there's one right here. Or at least get that. Yeah, look at that dog.
No, it wasn't letting me roll. Damn. Dude, I was crushing. get a new controller. Oh crap. They're in this area. One at a time, give it to me. Easy. I feel like this is slightly new. There's a switch somewhere. Oh, I... Okay, I think I see. No, just... One, there's one more, one more.
Uh, there's just one more switch we have to hit, and then we can just like rush through and grab the teleport, and then we're then we're chilling. Oh, I was like, what the hell? Oh, and the switch is like right here. Perfect. Hell yeah, Pichu. No! <laughs> Shit. I think we're gonna have to battle our way, or battle our way up the steps. This is an N64 game, but I am playing a remaster of it, uh, where they, you know, modernize the the look the quality, the visual quality of the game and the controls, but they add a lot of content, like new weapons and enemies and levels and game modes and stuff. It's it's really great. One of my favorite uh, N64 games, and then the remaster just makes it even better. So yeah, I highly recommend. swapping. We just want regular swapping. The main character is not actually a dog. I'm just using a cheat that lets you play as a dog. Alright, we are... <laughs> Favorite NC4 besides Rima? Oh, Goldeneye. Alright, so you can make that jump in the original, and I'm pretty sure you can still make it in the remaster. Um, not the intended way to reach that, but. Pew Pew game. Yeah! Yeah, funny how it works out. But, like. You know, this is very much like like an action-adventure, you know, shooter, third person, and then Goldeneye is obviously Goldeneye. Um, other favorite games, though, like Mystical Ninja Star and Goemon, I really like that one. Um, and then some other fighting games, like uh, Killer Instinct and Mortal Kombat. Dark Souls are <coughs> All right, so we're gonna try and run through this. So each of these temples, um, you like unlock an ability. Damn. And uh, and uh, you unlock an ability that has to like do with fire. That lets you progress more in the game. So that's. That's what we're going for here. That's what I tried doing the first time. Yeah, I don't... I think those obstacles are... are... new and improved. For the horror. Oh no. Oh no. Alright, Josh. This is, uh... This is harder. 
DK64 I never really got into. But I think it's because I grew up playing so much Donkey Kong Country, I just wanted it to be that. And so when it wasn't, I just like, you know, ignored it. Okay. I thought there was space in between the obstacles. Ocarina, I had never played until I got to it in my challenge. So that was my first time playing it. Um, it's a good game, very good game. Um, I like this one more. Whoa, whoa! Man, come on! Okay, I thought you could at least step on it and then jump. Whoops. Yeah, and Donkey Kong 64 is like insanely grindy because of all the collectibles and how only certain characters can pick up certain collectibles. Like, it's just kind of an insane game model. Dude, yeah, all right. There is definitely not triple swingy death things in the original. Okay, I have to go this way. You basically have to do every level five times. Yeah, exactly. All right, this is like the place to save. Great. All right, health would have been good. I would have really liked some help. All right, so in here there are one, two, three, four switches I have to hit. But after each one, you know, another sister or two spawn. We'll see. If it's only one, then it's fine. The sisters are weak. I try to speed run. We'll see. Let's see if we can ignore the sisters. I need help. Got it. Conquer live and reloaded multiplayer. See, so, like, I didn't really play much Conquer multiplayer because I never had the game until college. Um, but, you know, I've heard from a lot of people that it's very good. The sisters awake. Yeah, I don't, I don't know if we can do this. Maybe. Maybe. The sisters awake. They don't just wreck me off the spawn here. Okay. No! No! I missed my jump. Shit. No! <laughs> All right, so you just can't. There you go, Josh. First one. Damn. The floor is definitely lava. But eventually, it doesn't hurt you. Eventually, you're just a voodoo god. An impervious fire. Alright. 
So we gotta get that one. Can we make that jump? No, we cannot make that jump. Damn. Oh, it's this isn't the actual character. I just have play his dog turned on. This is the character. He's a man. He's a man, all right? No! Dude, I keep hitting that angle. Shit. Can he be monkey? No, the dog is like an actual, you know, en like enemy in the game. You can play as a couple other enemies, but this is by far the best one. Was that so hard, Shadow Man? Wait, there's another one? Which one did I miss? That one? Oh, I got them all. It looks like I got it. Yeah. Damn it! Now there's too many sisters. Can't tell what's going on. Crap. <laughs> Unbelievable. No way it lets me save again, right? It didn't let you. Maybe they got rid of that feature. Oh, the one straight in the back. We didn't get that one. Just, we have to get, we have to get to it. And then we're golden. Look at that dog. Hell yeah. So what you can't see, because I'm the dog, is uh, we got these tattoos that let us touch those like fire blocks you saw earlier. So we, we can do that now. Shit. Um, which means we can leave here. Go to the Temple of Life. It's a, it's, it's a skull. The Tet de Mort.
we're going to be doing a little skipping ahead. We're not going to be exploring as much because I want to get to this one part to show you guys before the stream is over. Uh, Josh, I think you will like it because it is new content and it's quite cool. I think I'm going the right way. Maybe not. Let's see if there's a fire block here. Alright, I think I think we went the right way. Temple of Light? No. Life. This is the Temple of Life. Oh damn it. You know, it's good to get there, but not what I wanted. Unbelievable. God dang. Alright, let's try another path this time. This is still the same. This. Doggo is definitely the best, right, James? Alright, James, you actually, uh, it's good timing. We're about to get to, uh, something new for the remaster. Yeah, the worm, that worm pumping looks kind of intense. Sure, which which is the right? Come on! <laughs> Unbelievable! We're we're getting this. This is the this will be the the last thing I do for tonight. But we're we're gonna get it. That's such a troll platform because it's it's like a double length platform. Like every other one of those lava platforms in the whole game is one is a square and that one is like this long rectangle. So like after you've gotten so used to the jumping for the other ones, that one just trolls you. Look at that dog fly, man. We need thumbs. Get there. What? What? No. No, it's not what I wanted. Go this way all along. Josh, I'm Miles Poston. Oh no, dude's gonna nuke me. No! Whoops. Bird is climbing. Me, Poston. Alright, well, now we know. Oh, come on. Yo, JP, what's up, dude? Yeah, 
Yeah, look at that Bert go. Master climber Bert. Dang it. Ah! They're too strong. Teach you things to follow. Appreciate it. There's Smash on here sometimes. The last year and a half, there's been more Smash than anything else. But I used to play a lot of N64 games. No. It's controller, dude. All right, James, you haven't been around for the controller hate, but there's something wrong with my controller where sometimes when I attempt a long jump, it'll equip both weapons in my hands, and then I can't grab anything. It's a very, very fun issue. It's really been adding a lot to my game. I'm not that good at Smash. <laughs> Does it bother me? No, I don't. I don't like practice and compete anymore. But uh, I can definitely still hold my own. I'm not very good with Sheik. That's for sure. All right, have a good night. I don't know, you stick around for a few more minutes, you might see something cool. All right. All right, I'm gonna need that voodoo power. Alright. After new stuff. Sure, that's just lava. Yep, that'll just kill me. So we're, we're not doing that. Oh, I think I just fall here. And then, yeah, alright, I make that jump. Oh, I did the weapon thing. Really? Did it have to be that tough? Another one, yes. No. 
Oh no, I can't die, please. No! No! <laughs> Unbelievable. No, I'm definitely not that guy. World's worst? World's worst one, I missed it. Man. So close. Sometimes it, I sw it just doesn't want to jump when I push the button. Like, that was a really late jump, I almost died. Bottom 50th percentile. You're talking about yourself, James? I know you're uh, not the biggest fighting game fan. Did you have you gotten through Mortal Kombat trilogy? and Killer Instinct. Cause I mean, those are tough, but at least they're good. Mace the Dark Age is another one that's tough, but good. Crap, crap, crap. All right, is this way easier? This way is much easier. Where's that little bugger? Did I kill him? Cross kill? Oh my gosh. Got it. Alright, so I have to push that block that way. No. Push it straight. Mm. Alright, Josh. You ready for this? Killer Instinct and oh, Trilogy is the hardest one, in my opinion. De it depends on what you want to do. Huh? What in the name of God? Holy shit. I am the Lord of Dead Side. Oh, great. Dude, what the hell? What? Unbelievable. It's just a one hit kill? Oh, what was I thinking? I should have saved there. Oh, I'm so dumb. Yeah, dude, they added bosses in the game. There are there are multiple new bosses. Yeah, I guess those uh, big green things are just one-hit KOs. So I definitely had health going in, right? I think the version I played, like before this big update, that boss didn't have those ads. He just did like like tail attacks and stuff. That also might be because of the, the difficulty, because I'm playing on the horror. No, the, the other boss that's in this, one of the other bosses, is one that I haven't played yet. Um, that, that got added with this update. But the boss I was just fighting did exist in the version I played before. But I think that one attack was new. It's a mythic mechanic. One hit, one hit KOs, man. All right, well, I have to make 
next things up here. Oh, we got it. Hell yeah. We're god gamers. Yeah. Oh, yeah. This is, this is a strong weapon. Like, the Tempted Mort is still really good because of the homing attack, but this thing is, is legit. It does, it does some damage. It does big damn. But all right, we can uh, upgrade our health now, so it's huge. 100 Caddo given in offering to the lower shall greatly increase the strength of a man's spirit. That's how you got the baton. There just wasn't a boss there. That whole little section leading up to the boss and everything, and then the boss didn't exist, but the baton was still here. These gifts I give to thee, O oh gracious Loa, O oh generous Loa, a spiritual trade for life beyond. At least I'm pretty my sure. My force increases. Ah! All right, huge. <laughs> 